Good day, everyone. Hope you're doing well. Today we have an article from Inverse.com titled, Star Wars 9 Leaks May Confirm a Shocking Old Palpatine Rumor. So, yeah. Uh, if you like this kind of content, consider subscribing. It helps out the channel a lot. So now, let's get into this. Emperor Palpatine's involvement in Star Wars The Rise of Skywalker has created a lot of buzz ahead of the film's release. With his return, however, comes a lot of confusion. How will he return to the franchise? Has he been working behind the scenes this whole time? No one knows for sure, but thanks to recent leaks and rumors, a lot of people seem convinced that good old Sheev has been possessing Supreme Leader Snoke the entire time. Now, some Star Wars fans have dug up an old Episode 9 leak that seems sketchy when it first emerged, but is starting to look pretty legit, and it might reveal some exciting new details about the Emperor's role in The Rise of Skywalker. Back in February, a 4chan leak detailed Palpatine's possession of Snoke's body and how the former Emperor's consciousness returned to the MacGuffin after, after Kylo killed Snoke in The Last Jedi. The leak further suggested that Kylo would join forces with Rey to find and destroy the MacGuffin. Now it's worth mentioning that no one has an idea what the MacGuffin actually is. It sounds a lot like an object that Palpatine uses while he's between body transfers, and might even function a bit like one of Voldemort's Horcruxes. After all, any almost dead villain's first order of business would be to find a safe place for the essence, right? Redditor uh, CHRLTTVRN expands on the old new leak with some new substantial evidence that gives the original rumor solid foundation. The usually reliable Making Star Wars revealed that Kylo would be in search of a device referenced only as the Wayfinder. The name itself implies that it's a compass-like device that will be used to pinpoint exactly where Palpatine's hiding. This updated theory ties right back to Kylo's potential mission. Perhaps the Knights of Ren have been looking for the MacGuffin this whole time. And if they found it, then it makes sense to bring it to Kylo's attention. Finding the MacGuffin could prove difficult, however, since no one actually knows exactly what it is they're looking for. After all, there's no telling whether it could change or, or its shape or any other physical attribute. Is, the, uh, is it even an object? Still, even though the galaxy is huge, this Wayfinder device might function as a Palp's essence detector, which is why Kylo will have to join the Knights of Ren on their mission. The real challenge will be whether or not they'll be able to destroy the MacGuffin before Palpatine finds a new host, but the evidence at least helps to lay out Episode 9's potential plot. While the combination of this theory and the old league gives Kylo a mission, it does muddle its motivations and loyalties. Does the need to destroy Palpatine mean he's not really loyal to the dark side? Of course Kylo might want to kill the Emperor simply because he stands in the way of his dominance of the First Order and the galaxy. However, if Palpatine had been possessing Snoke all along, then Kylo's murder of the Supreme Leader makes sense as it stands to reason that Kylo saw the truth and decided to fight back. One theory even claims Kylo's been a double agent all this time. Regardless of Kylo's loyalties though, Palpatine is a far bigger threat, and it will take the combined powers of the Resistance and First Order to defeat him once and for all. So what do you think about this uh, older leak? Um, I, I still think that the Emperor transfers his essence to something and person to person, things like that. Whether he was actually Snoke this whole time, I don't know, but it would definitely be an interesting plot twist. Um, but yeah, uh, Kylo's definitely going to have to work with the Knights of Ren, at least for a while, but in the trailer, you do see him fighting them. So there must be something to that. Maybe the Knights of Ren are actually on Palpatine's side and, um, uh, and, and they don't care about, uh, following Kylo anymore. Who knows? Maybe Kylo turns on them when he turns, you know, when, if he's redeemed or not. So let me know your thoughts on this uh, older leak that someone has tried to make into a newer leak. Uh, do you think that the Emperor was Snoke? Or Snoke was the Emperor all this time? I don't know. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Alright? So as always, take care and have an awesome day.